Hello, hello. It's old Twit Talks cars again. I'm in the 330i 2019 BMW 3 Series once again. Uh, and I just wanted to share this with you because I've only really just noticed it and thought about it. So, look at these. They're a bit blingy, aren't they? No, I just really noticed that. Because these over here, a perfectly sensible BMW fare and yet why didn't they use something similar to that here it looks like I don't know it slipped through the net and they would got some knocking about from a x6 or something so that's a weird thing um, I'm just telling you weird and wonderful things as they occur to me this I've got all this stuff switched off because that malarkey feels like it's trying to drive for me so it, it, it sort of introduces torque steer because what it does when you go over the white lines it sort of can quite aggressively snatch you back and it just feels like uh, a bit of torque steer happening at inappropriate times or someone tugging the wheel from you and for me I don't like it I like to feel that I can keep within the white lines despite being old and a bit of a twit um, however what I do like to try and balance it up a bit the old speed um, limit recognition mechanism in this car is very very accurate I've never had any issues with it it literally changes the moment you change you go through from one speed limit zone to another so that's pretty good and frankly I'd be lost without that in a car now because cars are so quiet and capable uh, it's very very easy in a car like this to break the speed limit more of which later I'm just looking around as I had two not so positive things to say to find another positive thing okay storage is pretty good excuse the coffee cup but there's a decent cubby in there two cup holders there this thing's pretty generous don't ask me why I've got glue in there my son asked me that and I had no very good answer to him um, so storage is good bins are all right but not lined with anything bit of felt in there even the French cars put some felt in in those bins helps things not be rattly um, and that's really all I've got for you right now without clearly boring you into a stupor so please um, check out my blog if you're desperately bored details are below and I'll see you again soon probably back in this car